What is up, you guys? It's your favorite to reader, and I am back with the next read. Okay, honey. Period. Period. That. All right, y'all. I am taking personal readings. You guys can catch at me at Money Sign Caprice Cooks. You can also email me or Apple Pay me at Caprice Cooks at iCloud.com. All right. All right. I work on energy. Energy is fluid, so this could be about you. This could be about the person that you're thinking about, or anybody's thinking about you. Also, time is an illusion, so this could be about the past, the present, or the future, but somehow it's affecting you right now, okay? All right, it is 1.21 p.m., 33, thank you, it's in the Masters, and it is 6.50, okay? Thank you, it's in the Masters. Feel free to look up any angel numbers mentioned in this video. All right, y'all, let's go ahead and get started. Spirit, guys, it's in the Masters, so family, twin flame, family, please be here with me at this time, helping me receive a message to deliver to my Geminis for March 7th through the 14th any messages for them i feel like a lot of y'all got allergies like a lot of y'all have sensitive skin um a lot of y'all are just having like a lot of sensitive emotions crying back and forth having like bipolar episodes i'm just saying and i'm not saying bipolar like that i'm just saying like um somebody could be off their meds in the family but i also feel like it just it's kind of just like um purging going through like surgical surgery like one minute you up one minute you down but i feel like god is just showing you your ups and your downs god is just showing you maybe things that need to be worked on i feel like you're in this transformational energy and that's why you're going back and forth because i feel like you're needing to learn how to have a happy medium how to be in touch with your emotions without like lashing out um i said that in the aries reading as well and right now, I feel like something is in my nose. I feel like something is blocking your hairs or something is, like, blocking your information. Something is, like, clogging your pores or something like that. I feel like somebody needs to change their body wash or their face wash or something like that. Also, I feel like somebody could just not be taking care of their feet or not be taking care of, like, their skin. It's kind of like maybe you don't put on lotion. Maybe you don't put on lotion in the summer. But I feel like if you want to go traveling and all that kind of stuff, I feel like your skin needs to be worked on all the time. Because you can tell when somebody just put on lotion for one day. Like, one, two, three, thank you, it's in the master. It's one, two, three. Um, but yeah, you don't want to have cracks in your skin. I feel like somebody also has, like, acne, um, insecurity, um, like, back acne. I'm hearing somebody just feels like people never hear take the time to get to know them, like, all of them. Definitely check out the Aries reading that I just did. But yeah, I feel like somebody doesn't see their stardom. They don't they don't see their fame. They don't see their worth. They don't see how much love they could have, you know. The twelfth house, surrender. I feel like somebody's needing to kind of like um surrender to their journey, surrender to the things they don't like about themselves, communicate with God, and then expand on them. You know, anything that you don't like about yourself, I feel like work on it. You know, you don't have it doesn't have to be a secret. I feel like you could talk about it. I feel like it's it's the need to kind of like open up and be vulnerable with somebody. I feel like you're on the edge of a good relationship, you're on the edge of your happiness, you're on the edge of your finances, of your success, you know bringing that fire back that passion back into your relationship even if y'all are going through some challenges you could be um you could be the gemini from the aries reading that i was talking about about the marriage working on your marriage or whatever but i feel like y'all rolling the dice maybe y'all move into a different town or something like that i feel like it's a sense of kind of like y'all were on a roller coaster going back and forth with the same kind of shit or maybe you have been on a roller coaster of emotions going through the same kind of shit with the same kind of niggas and it's just kind of like you ready to date a different type of nigga you ready to date the nerd you ready to date um a jamaican or a white guy or somebody out of your race or somebody out of your tax bracket or somebody out of your league or, or something like that i don't know why i said out of your league because bitch ain't nobody out of your league okay i'm just saying but i feel like it's kind of like god is being very generous right now with the rainbow here i feel like you're very lucky like you feel lucky you feel like god is just blessing you i just heard see a penny pick it up um definitely